Hey guys, welcome back to WP Event Manager. In this video, we're gonna take a look at our very awaited add-on called Export Events. Of course, you can export your whole website data using WordPress built-in exporter tool, but our export events brings a lot to the table on the website to me for admins or organizers to export events from the front end or from the back end side. To find about more details about our export events add-on, you can always visit our official website at wp-eventmanager.com and visit the add-ons page to find about the details and the pricing option. So let's go ahead and open the page for our export events to look at the feature overview and the pricing availability. And we will find the export event at our second page of the plugins listing page. We can see, uh, let's go inside and we will talk more about it shortly. So as you can see, we have personal and developer license both available for the export event. As I already said, export event serves one functionality to the website, but with many micro features, right? Backup is really important for like regular usage for data recovery and stuff and for redundancy as well. So export events makes your life little more easier to let you control what fields you need to export and what field you do not want to export using this add-on and you can export these add-ons in a CSV format. So let's look at the featured overview over here. We have export CSV that I just talked about. We have selected field that I just talked about as well and we will find a link to the documentation to find about written documentation about this add-on as well and event dashboard so this is the export event uh, feature i just talked about from the front end so it will allow you to export all events as a csv file from the front end side and you can even export the csv with custom options like what field you want to keep and what field you don't we have the same demonstration over here as well in our next highlighted feature and then we have default export settings at the admin panel. So export type or export settings can be selected or modified from the admin panel as well for default. And then we have custom export settings at admin panel as well. So custom admin panel, whether you want to show some fields or not for the export to available from the front end side that you can do from the admin panel, right? So you can modify the plugin as you want. As I said, the WordPress default exporter doesn't allow you to like switch or modify the fields you want to export really for a type of post meta but our exports even add-on lets you control the plugin fully and as you require it so enough talk about the feature overview we're gonna take a look at how we can install it and activate it so for that let's head over to our WordPress environment we can go to plugins then add new from here we will click on the upload plugin button then we're going to click on choose file and from here we will choose our plugin package so that's wp-event-manager-export next we can click on open and then click on install now and after clicking on install now we will see a screen like this where we have to click on activate plugin it will take us to our installed plugin page from where we can activate the license key for our add-on. So I have my license key with me, copy it to my clipboard. You will find the license key at your inbox after completing the purchase. Let's check on this tick box and then we will type out our registered email address over here. And then all we need to do is hit enter from our keyboard. That will go ahead and activate the add-on for us. Come join me in our next video to experience the plugin in action in our front end side where we will export default type export or custom export in this website as well until then i'm sharad saying goodbye thanks for watching and i'll catch you in the next one